And here we are. Let's see how that thing is. I don't know how well you can hear. Give you an idea of This is the Cumberland National Gap, the National Gap, whatever you call it. It's Cumberland National Gap. They go different, it's called loops for different campsites. This is D and they don't want, D is primitive. A is primitive. B and C have got electric. It goes all the way down to, I think, O. It's got trails, which I'm not walking on trails. I'm sorry, not going to happen. Good point. Here you go. Let's see if I can get a close up. Oh, I'm not walking up trails for nobody. They had a thing last night where the, um, the rangers want to set up every Saturday night to do a uh, trails, and that's the amphitheater. Now, last year, a couple years ago, we were running outside that spot, and there was a camper there from uh, Hawkins County. This is the first time we've been up here in two years. It is gorgeous. It really honestly is. That's all campers with electric. Dump station, you know, you RVs over there. Now, the people who work here, the National Park Service, or whatever they are, they are here. They started at like 6 30 in the morning. I know I got up that early and they were here. I don't want this building for. I know it's part of the park. But you get to get back to nature. It's actually gorgeous. Now, if this phone holds enough memory to do something, I may have to do it in two different videos. But something, we got a tunnel I got to go through to get into Kentucky. I don't know where that road there goes to. And I always thought that tunnel was there for... Roosevelt or Eisenhower. But my wife looked it up last night, and it's only been there since 1996. Because see, this park, right now we're in Virginia. And about a mile away, we could cross back into Tennessee for about two or three minutes at best. Then you cross back into Kentucky once you get out of the tunnel. Which is where the Walmart is at and everything else. There's a field over there. I don't know what, what that's for. I was like, well, next we're going to start moseying up somewhat north. We got to be somewhere in being in June. I know I, I'm, we may be going to Maine in July. I'm not sure. This is Highway 58. And it is pretty. 
yesterday we were coming back, I went up my regular gas. And uh, National Park Ranger, Park Forest Ranger, pulled somebody over up here. It's like, oh, what did we do? Interesting. But if you look up Cumberland uh, National Park and look at its history, it's amazing. My wife said the first buffalo used to roam, roam around all over here. Davy Crockett was used to be up in here. Over settled Nashville, he came through this way to get to Nashville. I, which from what she read, he was in East Tennessee, but came up here to go to Nashville. I don't understand that one at all. He was, and there's the Tennessee Welcomes you signed. See, we got a pass. Now, for me, I don't have to pay for it because I'm on Social Security Disability. But we got a pass that uh, gives me a lifetime member, lifetime of camping on any national park for half price. I was like, saying, no uh, parkway, we're going to take that up next. Well, that's an interesting little thing. And I, they charge on that. And if I got to double check what the guy said or anything like that, we get we don't have to pay for. And it's like that works for me because that's going to be thirty bucks. I know the last time my dad came down, he said, he's going to take it and find out how much it's going to cost. And he said, nope, not doing it. Because he had an RV with a, a camper. Has Matt Lane clothes. I'm surprised. This is the beginning of the tunnel. And I apparently used to go over oh, that, well, they call it a mountain, I'll call it a hill. This was only built, done in 1996. How long it took them to make it, I have no idea. Whoops, I'm speeding. So is everybody else. And we got workers up there working on. I don't know, they have offices up there. Huh. Welcome to the inside of the tunnel. Guarantee it's nice and clean. It's beautiful in here. It's cool temp wise. I've been doing these video series. I'm, I'm, I'm going to screw up along the way, guys. I already tell you that now. I'm not any professional doing this stuff. In case you watched this far. But you. It's something that a lot of people don't see. I was like, we're talking about going up to Gettysburg. I was up there when I was a little kid. My wife and I like history. And I seen wagon, the old-fashioned wagon rust back in the 80s when I went moved out to Oregon. And we're out of the tunnel. And guess what? That sign there says, Welcome to Kentucky, Bell County, Kentucky. Now, this first exit is takes you to the visitor center for the National Park. It says all this is National Park. This is all federally owned. And, um, and if you ever come up there, I go into that visitor center. The other day was the first time we ever did, and I'll tell you what, it's amazing. Now, uh, I warn you, it's going to be a total different change of scenery here in about eh, five seconds. Because around this bend is the Middleborough, Kentucky, home of the Majors Bionic Man. <laughs> 